Hi guys, it's Half I am back again, and this is going to be my intro video for 20 in 2020, which I am doing in collaboration with a whole bunch of people from the Geeks and Beauties. Now, some of us are using a theme, which is places, um, and some people don't have enough stuff that is place stuff. So they're not using places, they're just using stuff in their makeup collection, which is fine. Um, so if you want to join in, feel free to use products that have place names. Or uh, if you get really stuck and you really want to stick to the theme, you can always use Maybelline New York, Rimmel London, LA Colour, LA Splash, LA Girl. Any brand that has a place in its name, um, you could pretty much get away with, quite frankly, um, as far as I'm concerned. So uh, I have a couple of products that fit that because I didn't really have enough. Um, well, I did, but I didn't want to overdo it in certain categories. Um, yeah, so let's get into the things that I will be including in this project pan. A couple of them, in fact, three of them are also in my team project pan project, um, simply because there was a crossover between them. Um, there's more eyeshadow stuff and lipstick stuff in this one um, because they're the ones that have place names mostly. Uh, yeah, so let's get started. First up is the one one of the ones that's in my other project Which is the clean color tanned raw matte bronzer in Fiji matte which Looks like that I have to be kind of careful with it because it is a little on the dark side um, But a light hand and it's fine. Um, I also used it on my eyes today and it was fine Also in that other project is my contour shade this is Havana from Australis which is an Australian brand um, I also use that on my eyes as well as my contour today because it works for both things so next we have um, this eyeshadow here this is Green Bay from Cargo so, Green Bay is obviously a place and right next to it we have Caribbean Sea which is from Girly Cosmetics so they're all in my magnetic palette um, to be used um, then we have these are in kind of like a mixed up kind of order because I just sort of randomly assigned things I have 20 things here if I use up something which doesn't seem very likely with things that I've picked um, I will add something else in but I don't think too much of this is actually gonna get finished up um, so we have a lipstick from JCAT this is Miami red which is quite a dark kind of berry color it's not really what I would consider a red it's more berry toned but that's fine um, we have Vegas Vault, which is part of my other project um, from MAC, which is kind of an orangey color. Um, I tried panning this before, so <laughs> it's... Um, the JCAT one is brand new, never been used. Uh, then we have the uh, L'Oreal Balmain by L'Oreal Lipstick Range. This is Balmain Instinct. This is my odd color for this project because it is kind of um, a grayed out green. And it's going to have at least one odd color in. Uh, then we have from Satin, um, we have Genoa, which is a lipstick liner, which is very neutral, so pretty much can go under anything. It's also brand new never been used we have Brooklyn Thorn from NYX liquid suede one of the little mini ones from the vault collection which is a grayed out brown shade we have Orange County from NYX liquid suede which obviously is orange And I do love a good orange lipstick. So that's Orange County. From Ofra, I have Laguna Beach. This 
This one might not last out the year. It is starting to get quite... Seems to be drying out a little bit. But it is very much a neutral. Not that much different from what I'm wearing, which is tea and cookies from NYX. Um, I have lip gloss, which is Tinseltown from Revlon which you probably can't really see. It's got a pink sheen to it. Um, lots of glittery bits in it. But that is Tinseltown from Revlon. I have an eyeliner, which if you've been watching my channel for a while, you've seen this before. This is Emerald City from Mian. Uh, it's what I've got underneath my eye under a, um, an eyeshadow, which I will show you in a minute. Uh, from the Revolution Metal uh, Metal Crush Pigment Palette, um, there is a shade in here called Vegas, which is this one right here. Oh, it's a purple. It's not a super dark color. It's quite light, but I'm sure it will build up. It'll be a good lid color. Uh, we have another lipstick. This is one of the soft matte lip creams from NYX. This is Zurich, which I bought a couple of years back for an A to Z. Or was it last year? Project Pan, because um, I wanted a Z. So again, kind of a neutrally color. Um, then we have four pigments from Glamadol Eyes or Glitters. We have Fiji Mermaid, which is a green colour. It's sort of more teal than green. Uh, we have Hollywood, which is a holographic, almost holographic, I think it's holographic. Can't really see it at this angle. Um, it's actually just a straight up glitter which does not want to focus. There we go. Straight up glitter. Um, it is... Um, the Glamadol one, Glamadol eye ones tell you, see this one is lip and eye safe, so it does actually tell you that, which is good. We have Lexington, which is a white with little glittery bits in it. Um, which is apparently lip safe. Cool. And then we have Tokyo, which is a pale purpley color. So yeah, there's some continuity there. There's lots of greens and purples, which sort of blend all the bits in together, which is quite good. And lastly, we have from Be A Bombshell, we have the New York Sh City eyeshadow quad, which has black, gray, dark green, and a uh, sort of white color in it. Um, I have the dark green under my eyes and I have the black in the outer corner. Um, yeah, so I kind of used stuff from both of my projects on my face today. Yeah, so that is it for this intro. Um, if you want to subscribe to me, then you need to click the bell down the bottom and click the little the little icon that looks like a bell next to it. You need to click that um, in order to get notifications if you want them. Um, don't forget to check out the other girls who will be listed down below who are involved in this project. Leave me a thumbs up if you like Project Pan type videos and leave me a comment down below. I will like your comment and I will answer any questions that you ask me. And I will see you in my next video. See ya.